Hello everyone, Xenu and Zimmer yeah. Xenu and Zimmer here, and welcome back to more Let's Play Pokemon Brilliant Diamond. Last time, we went to Iron Island, and this time, it's time to face the gym. Ah, the one gym, the one that the few gyms that didn't get a remodel. Now, I brought back everyone, and yeah, because of this gym, you're probably going to want to see about three members of the team. Still represents the fake spirit. Never give up the power of victory, you feel itself. Because we are facing the steel type. I have an interesting history of steel types because Pokemon Pearl is actually the first game I did a uh, steel type run, run, and I actually beat the game. Yeah. Of course, I did trade in Pokemon, but honestly. Very low level. It makes all these things very good. Uh, what team I used? I used Pimple Climb, which was the only Pokemon that I believe was not steel at first. But I used Spirit Gear to get out there. I used Steelix. I use Bronzong. I use Magnezone, which was interesting. I will not lie. It was very, very, very interesting. Uh, I use Caesar, I remember if I'm right. Okay, 
So first of all, I'm gonna give Terra two. What? Terra's evolving. Normally we don't do this. But Terra's starting to like uh big these evolve. We've got Right on. So we can get its next evolution. Ooh. Oh, hammer is pretty good though. Debating it. I'm legit really debating it because it's actually quite a good move. I'm actually not going to take it though. Ah. Oh. Okay. And with that, let's put Pokemon. There we go. Yeah, we'll have probably all of Pokemon. Except Angel, because Angel can't evolve. Uh, worker Gerardo. 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 I'm not good with names. <laughs> Especially if I don't know how to pronounce them. Now, Aqua is going to do this on it. Okay. Let's draw some poison. That's a good move. We're actually, going to get rid of Venom Shot. Because Cross Poison is just better. Jimmy, you have Onyx. What, you have any Malgots? Goodbye. Finally, Scorpia is evolving. We evolve from a poison bug type into a poison dart type. I don't get why he turns into a poison, poison dart type. <laughs> but still, it's kinda cool. Now, you can see everyone with Pokemon, except for Terra, because it's a tough protector, it's fully really evolved. Once we beat the gym, I will probably look for why what they need to reference to like I promised so long ago. How? It's sad. And you're a quarter fan, you can't computers. That is the one. And if this was before, it's very tight. 
I would probably have a strong just like for this matchup. But it's not. Steel doesn't resist dark anymore. Making steel, it's not that frantic. It's so annoying. Okay. It looks like he just did What is this going on first? Oh, what the bag. That was a critical. I know I'm pretty high level now. I am trying to not die. Yeah, for some reason she has a zoomer and they don't get that at all. She's like we train her, but for some reason has what, what am I doing? It's very have a steel type that is bulky you had a zero roll which is now we finally reached top and now before we start prep talking to this guy I have to say I love this guy Nami oh Byron is one of my favorite characters because he's so energetic you probably you probably heard from so many people because so many people love Byron because it's like you think it's gonna be like this stoic character of people. I am Byron. You come to defeat me. <laughs> well, let us bow. But he's there, he's like, I love our defense! It's so great. Dan Green makes his character amazing. I'm not gonna do it as amazing, because I'm probably gonna kill my voice, but I'm gonna try. Ah, that's the Orbur's Chin Badge! I see, I see. You defeated my son. But that's no surprise. He is still much to learn. You place my son, Rourke. I, Byron, will accept your challenge. That close up just looks weird though. Oh, that, that is definitely. That is definitely a character. <laughs> We meet Bronzor! This thing is annoying. <laughs> but I love it. But thanks to no longer having a dark, it's not that bad. And this is another thing I wish they'd get rid of. Ah. Virus is out Steelix! Of course. 
Oh. Last one, this one will make our last time. Because he sends out Bastiodon! Oh, I love Bastiodon! Bastiodon is very bulky and really annoying to sit down. But since how high level we are, we're probably. Oh, almost nuked it. But sturdy. I forgot it had sturdy. That's great. I love Bastion. Flash can! We're not done yet. There's no giving up. I'm surprised I didn't use our defense. I wanted to shout, our defense, our defense, our defense, our defense, our defense, our defense! I'm so sorry for you, Trumps. I love Byron. <laughs> uh. My sturdy Pokemon, defeat it! You were strong enough to take down my prize team of Pokemon. In recognition of that power, I give you this, the Mind Badge! I'll be cleaning those badges. You received the Mind Badge from Byron. I mean, the man badge never was retrieved, but it didn't straight from your Pokemon at any time. Now, you know, six gym badges! That means all Pokemon to level 70 will be without question. Here, take these two! Obtain stickers from Byron, that Byron uses. You obtained TM91s! Let's all take it together now. I love Flash Cannon! These TM91 contains the move Flash Cannon! If it hits, it may also lower the target's special defense. I love Flash Cannon, no, no, ironically. I actually think Flash Cannon's a good move. I wish I had a Pokemon that could use it though. But no. So, that. Long way to Oh my god, I'm getting vertigo. This is the first time I game has ever actually given me vertigo. Oh, I actually feel dizzy. Hey, that's the mind badge. Good going. You're even tough enough to take a shot at becoming Pokemon champion. Of course, I'm tougher, so that's not actually gonna happen. Anyways, Zeno, come with me to the library. And we will later. 
I did promise. So, let's go heal our Pokemon. Let's talk about the names of each of them. Let's start off with the first Pokemon we got. Turtles. Turtles is a reference to Zeke Chronicles 2. There's a character I like called Zeke Von Genbu, bringer of chaos. And he's great, because he's got a lot of death. But, he also has a mascot that he and his blade, Pandoria, bring along, called Turtles, who is absolutely adorable, and how Zeke introduces him, as you probably can tell, is Turtles, reveal yourself! And then uh, panics when you find Zeke can he finds it, he misplaced his turtle. Which is great, which is the second reason why I chose Turtles as Turtles' name. Next in the line is QB and Raptor. They're actually a reference to Dark Starks. A fight game, but I gotta play a bit. I actually like Dark Starks a bit, because it's it's just I don't know why. I've no I'm not a fan of that many fighting games, because really the only traditional fighting game I like is KOF. I, I like Dark Stalkers, I might just the lore. And because that's Queen the Queen Bee, I thought, you know what? Make a pun out of it. QB. Next we got Aqua. Well, technically we got Aqua before, but we could have got QB earlier. Aqua is a reference to a lot of games, technically. Because there's a lot of characters that I apparently know about our dick Aqua. So, I couldn't really name just one of them. Because, honestly, I was impressed that my characters were named Aqua. Granted, my immediate thought was actually. Kingdom Hearts. Next, we have Scorpia. It was meant to be called Scorpio. You can probably tell what I'm probably referencing because I did want to be too on the nose. Granted, he's also a reference to an actual character called Scorpio. I don't remember where, where it's from. I know it's from the game I played, but it's been so long that I cannot tell you what. Angel, not only is a reference to my own past because I do see Absol as a guardian angel, but also a reference to King of Fighters, to a character called Angel, who's a reference to, of all things, Dwayne The Rock Johnson. Yes, really. And as a character that I actually weirdly know how to play and I don't know how. I don't play Angel that much because I prefer to play as Terry, Kate Ash, and Iori. But I do know how to play as her. Surprisingly. And Terra is again. I apparently know a lot of character notes and Terra, and I don't know why. <sighs> it's weird. But he it's actually a shorter name of Teranosuke. And I don't remember where to... I know what character I'm thinking of and I'm blanking. And he's from a game, that's all I remember. But before we end off... Right, that's why I went in here. To switch in Raptor.
has a heart. So we should find. Even though Bidoof comes out. Oh, come on! You're not even worth my time! Leave! I don't want to fight you! I want to try and get Earthquake from Terra! <laughs> Power startled me. No, it didn't. Leave me. Bloody hell. Unless you're shiny, I'm not catching you. Aqua is going to directions. Well, sorry, Aqua, because we're not fighting. Is this place has. Things about it. I don't believe it has strength though, so I'm gonna have to replace you with Dab Dab. Man, I could get it, but strength's actually a good sort of good move, so I don't. It to be given to Mew, just in case. Okay, so now there's a Max Eber. Easier. They better not be still the same level, because if they are, I would be upset, because they blocked us off. Oh my god! You blocked it off, and yet... This means catching Gibble is going to be annoying. Because yes, Pokemon here, and his name is Gibble, and it's part of an evolution line that is very well known. To the point that I partly wanted to, I debated raising one, raising one, I was going to say, I'll leave it up to you guys if I should raise one or not. No joke. And then, I got pushed back. And that plan got thrown away because of strength. So I was like, oh, alright. Well, then I'll just probably not. I'll raise one on the side just to show you guys how awesome Gorchomp is. Grand, we'll find out how awesome Gorchomp Gorch is because there's another quite a fight that has Gorchomp. Damn! Five. 
Run and get the gibble. Come on. Flash, honestly fine. But you don't. Annoying. Oh my god, I'm not gonna ever get give a lot of my mind game? Fine. Oh my god. TM26 Earthquake. Before I forget, and I'm not allowing that to happen, where's Rhyhorn? Where's Terra? Terra, you're learning this now. I'm not forgetting. And before, just get rid of that. Earthquake. Scorpio kill three? What? I'm not teaching it that though. If I ever somehow get another Earthquake TM, maybe. But get rid of Bulldoze. It's, it's, it's not being reliable anymore. With that, that's all for this episode. Next time, we'll be seeing another part of this game because I'm also sure it is dark. And if it isn't, I'm going to be so mad. See you guys then. Zeno Zima, signing out.